she came to, to the office and she was talking and, and people were in the, in the office. She didn't fix her hair. She had a bad hair too that day. And I said, whoa, Fumi, you are looking great. You're just perfect. He said, thank you, daddy. He said, everybody's been complaining that I look dirty, I look rough. He said, don't mind that you are looking. And then someone said, that is messing with you. That is not telling you the truth. <laughs> and then she talked to me and said, daddy, is it true? You are not telling me. Am I okay? really okay? Mm, I said, he said, so you are flattering me. <laughs> he said, you are lying. You are a man of God. You should have told me I'm not looking right. So when he told me I'm okay, I was just happy. So I said to myself, I will never flatter any man. The, the worst thing you can do to yourself is to flatter yourself or to be flattered. Tell yourself the truth. Look at yourself. Am I living the kind of life I want to live? Is this the kind of life I want to live? Is this the place I want to be? Now, if the answer is no, then it calls for a change. The lady come and said, and my pastor said, he said, demon is pursuing. I said, come to church. I said, pastor, I have my job. Can I come in the afternoon? I say, in the afternoon, the, my pastor too is not around. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because I have a pastor. This anointing I'm carrying now cannot be here in the afternoon. It will come in the evening again. To keep it, I will die before my time. I'm telling you. You don't keep this thing every 24 hours. I'm not a man of God 24 hours. Hello. Hi. Pastor won't tell you what I'm telling you. You know why? Because they want to look big before you. You can't be in the spirit 24 hours. So when we are on the altar, there is a different impact. Because we are asking to his calling. And we have no choice to deliver what he's saying to us. Amen. So, you don't want to miss any opportunity to be on this altar. A woman came and she was here in the morning yesterday, lying on this altar, praying, praying, praying. I didn't pray for her. When she was going to say, there's a deep encounter, and she wrote a check, and nobody asked her. He said, I, I saw God. This man of God. And she left. I, I, she left, I didn't say, God bless you, receive your prayer. No prayer. There's no prayer because God already had prayed for her. Yes. <laughs> for me to pray, so we should try to show that it's me that did yeah, the miracle. I'm not the miracle worker. Right. God is the one that wrote the miracle. Right. 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 Thank you, Jesus. You will live long for telling the truth. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody listen to me. Yes. Just stay with God. And when you find a place like this where God resides, then maximize the opportunity. You can walk in at appointment, just come and stay. You don't need to even see us. Just stay on. Say, Lord, just stay here. Say, Lord, I have come. This is my life. Turn me around for good. Yeah, yeah. Cry to your creator. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, he is on this fire. Yeah, yeah. He's on this altar. The woman that was to die with cancer, just single prayer, the cancer was removed and she lived. The first breast was taken away. The second breast was to be cut in and we said no. She drank water and the cancer disappeared from the second breast. Hey. Yeah, very yeah, I mean, life. Yeah. Yeah. What are you talking about? Raw miracle. And the doctor said, this is strange. How many will I count? God would did it for them as the same capacity is ever new every day Amen. to do something new for you too. Amen. As you are standing up right now, take delivery of your miracle. Amen. Take delivery of your blessing. Amen. Take delivery of your increase. Amen. Take delivery of your breakthrough. Amen. Take delivery of your healing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Every sickness in your body disappears. Lift up your hand and begin to thank him. Begin to give him praise. Oh, thinking about Muzuki Abadada. 
Maladozuka Baladia Moshintayada Ifranta Kabadia Marandu Marandaya Marapita Atandayada Ifrinti Kibu Ladausia Inti Kabaya Diada Marandi Kiabada Burandu Hida Thank you, Father. Stretch your two hands before your face. Lord, I prophesy to those ends. From today, your end shall not be empty of the blessings of God. The parcel of your blessing in 2015. I decree, let the heavens rearrange it for you and take delivery right now in the name of Jesus. The things that will make you sing a new song this year, the happenings, the passions, the, the mails that you will receive, that will color your destiny this year. Receive such passion in the name of Jesus. I decree upon those ends that whatever you set this hand to do, when you go back to your office tomorrow, when you go back to your place of work tomorrow, whatever you set this hand to do, receive answers to them in the name of Jesus. Every document that carries your name, that the enemies have sat upon, every document that carries your name, that the enemies have marked for destruction, every document or picture of yours or cloth or whatever that is yours, that the enemy has marked and that is troubling your destiny. Today, I reverse the curse in the name of Jesus. Is there any part of your body that has been tampered with? Is there any part of your body that has been afflicted with sickness? Is there any part of your body that has been cast with pain? Hear the voice of Jehovah God. Right now, you are healed. You are healed. You are delivered in the name of Jesus. Shout it out as amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. The believers, amen, is louder. If you're so excited, give him a round of applause and a shout of praise. Take your seat. Who is blessed this morning? You are going back home rejoicing. Amen. Get ready. You shall receive the full call of testimony this week. Amen. You shall not have a bad news this week. Amen. Every appointment with failure is cancelled right now. Amen. Every appointment with disgrace is cancelled right now. Amen. Every appointment with pain is cancelled right now. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Woman, you shall deliver safely. Amen. There shall be no complication. Amen. Come, come, I want to pray for you. There shall be no complication. On the day of your delivery, you shall have the baby like, the, like an Hebrew woman. In the name of Jesus, you shall deliver like an Hebrew woman and you shall not be afflicted. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I set this oil upon this woman. And today, I set your baby in order for safe delivery. In this pregnancy shall not trouble you. Amen. And no evil hand shall touch this pregnancy. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. On the day of your delivery, the witches and the witches shall be caused to sleep. Amen. They shall wake up only after that you are delivered. Amen. And they shall have no power over, over you and your baby. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Have it done. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. It's well with you. Amen. Are you blessed now? Amen. Safe delivery. The baby will not trouble you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Who is blessed again? Yes. See, I, I am blessed. I am blessed. Hallelujah. Amen. Anyone with testimony this morning? Hallelujah. Amen. Give them a microphone. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. 